So it's 12.59, I woke up kind of late. I did wake up late, <laughs> I woke up at like 10 a.m. I don't know, I've just been so tired lately. I think it's try it's me trying to like kick off late winter blues cause I do good all winter. I really like get into the mode of whatever season I'm currently experiencing but it's just kind of hard when the rest of the world is starting to get ready for spring and flowers blooming and everything and here it's going to be winter until like May 20th, June, early June. So um, yeah, just trying to kick that I think by sleeping a little bit extra. But I'm feeling hungry this morning and I found some organic mangoes at Natural Grocers and the only fruit I've had for like the past five months is apples, oranges, some bananas here and there, and um, the occasional blueberry. It is so windy outside. There goes my plans of basking in the sun. <laughs> um, so I'm really stoked to have found a mango and um, enjoy some tropical fruit because dang, I miss it. I'm ready for melon season. The juice bill, it just keeps getting higher and higher. I need for watermelons to come back in season so that I can have juice for days and it not break the bank. So, um, yeah, I'm about to have some breakfast and I will show you guys what it is whenever I get done crafting it. I found the best dates ever at Costco the other day and they're only 11 bucks. Look how squishy they are. Look at that, they're so gooey. And this is the butter I like to put in them. It is kind of tart due to the figs and it's just delicious. I found this at Natural Grocery Store. I've never cooked with tofu before, except for this kind, because I have a soy intolerance and this is pretty um, soft tofu. So I'm going to be pressing this. I think that's what you do with tofu usually. I don't know. I'm winging it. Um, I'm going to press this in a paper towel with like a cast iron on top of it so that it will expel some moisture. And I'm just going to let that sit for like 15 minutes or so before I make this vegan eggless salad. I'm still hungry. I um, didn't realize how hungry actually working out makes you. I usually do really like yoga. I don't even think you could really consider it a workout, just more of stretching. But I actually worked out this morning and I am hungrier than I've been in a long time. So let's make this egg salad. Hopefully it turns out good. We'll see. All right. <laughs> Mmm, soggy paper towel. I would like to mention that I've also never had egg salad, but I'm going for a kind of like potato-y salad flavor, I suppose. For whatever reason, this hemp tofu already has a kind of like sulfury smell to it. So, um, I guess that's a good thing. Now for the fun part, which is spices and pickles. I 
like a very tangy salad of any sorts really. I think mustard is probably necessary to get some depth in here. Of course vegan eggs. help but feeling like it lacked some nutty crunchiness so I chopped up some almonds and I'm just gonna toast them really quickly in a dry skillet and I think this is going to make this fully umami fully just satisfactory on all levels I threw the almonds in and it's looking good I mean mmm what do y'all think? I'm going to toast one of these little English muffins up and put the salad on it. Probably with just like some spinach. Keep it simple. I don't think I would put any more vegan eggs on this since it's already a pretty moist salad so just a little bit of thinly sliced avocado on the bottom a nice scoop of the salad on top some pea shoots so why not they're cute they're crunchy they're nutty there we have it She's cute, right? Okay. She fell apart a little bit. This is going to be a messy one, but that's okay. It's so cute with the little pea sprouts poking out. <laughs> oh. Mm-hmm. Dang. Okay, so I got a big toasted almond in the first bite, and I will say that's key. That flavor just came through, the texture just came through. That's key if you make this, put toasted almonds in it. This is fire, friends. This is gonna be a regular staple in my life from now on. Where have you been? Wow, I just love discovering new foods that are so simple to make, super nourishing. And I have leftovers for days. Hallelujah. I'm going to enjoy the rest of this. And go work on some herbalism. And I'll see you guys whenever I decide to eat something again. The next thing I'm going to consume is probably going to be cacao. I would just like to take a moment. Yes, those are Lisa Frank stickers. Yes, I still love Lisa Frank. <clears throat> Anyways, I would just like to take a moment of appreciation for my asparagus fern because look how far she's grown. Like, wow. That is amazing. I'm going to share a little life hack that really improves my life and my mood throughout the day. So, <clears throat> in the mornings, I like to turn on some form of like healing music meditation music and ideally the ones that have beautiful artwork to go with them this is one of my favorites and just keep it on super light throughout the day and it just improves the mood and the feng shui of the house so much like rather than this being a giant black blob on the wall it just comes to life the poor dog looks like he's getting blown away. I should probably let him inside. Is
Is it windy out there? I think I'm gonna brave the waters and go drink my cacao outside. No, no I'm not, it's too windy. I really want to, but I know I'm just going to be freezing out there. I'm already cold inside. So, I'm going to go to my room. I love my room because I can just open the window and it's like a little indoor-outdoor box. So, let's go do that. I've got to watch my cat. <laughs> he caught that! Did y'all see that? Oh my god. You are talented. Ready? <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. I'm having a blood orange as a snack. It's so pretty. Last meal of the day. It's late. This has been a weird day and this doesn't represent my daily eating habits because they fluctuate. But I'm having three of my barbecue lentil tacos. They're left over from when our friend was visiting and this really needs to get eaten up because it's pushing a week old. They are delicious and I will link my recipe video below. Thank you guys for watching. It's late and I'm tired. I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next time.